Greetings and welcome. This is Psychic Medium Roberto and I truly hope you are doing well today. I am guided by spirit and I'm recording this episode on July the 4th. Just gone past 6 a.m. in the morning, early bells. Trigger warning, the subject matter is a mature nature and deals with true crime events. Disclaimer, all cases are treated as alleged until proven in a court of law. Now, I'll be looking at the two Netherlands ladies that went missing, Chris and Lisa Ann, in 2014. Sorry, I'm just having a moment. Sorry, my empath levels just spiked there slightly. <laughs> All right, so this case, when this case went down, unfortunately, um, it pinged on me before my true crime days, right? But for some reason, this incident was a head turner at the time, and I recall this as if it was yesterday. So a couple of pieces of housekeeping before we get going. So let's just do a little bit of housekeeping on this chart here before we start. So the two ladies arrived in the area, which is here in Panama on March 29. That for me was important to know when they arrived in the area because it gives us a build-up of what transpired here. Then missing from April the 1st. Beg your pardon. Missing from April the 1st. When they went on a hiking trail. Here's a chair. In Panama. Um... And have since, of course, there was discovery. Now, I haven't included discovery information yet. I've got when they arrived and the time they went missing. And then now what I've got is, you'll note on the second row, which is a duplication of the top row, the first three blocks. And I've continued the number sequence to get an energy flow read of what transpired because you can just see just visually the amount of numbers on the bottom versus the amount of numbers at the top now it's too specific on the top whereas at the bottom it allows me to get play and see what is going on so that's why i've now included we can all agree march 32 33 34 35 does does not exist but creates an energy flow read for me we do know that remains were found i don't have that date here also i have not included any visuals from the jungle scenes each time i looked at the jungle scenes my blood curdles there's such dread in those hills. And I just watched a docky yesterday just to recap a bit. And there, were, there are other remains found in that vicinity. Not exactly a location to go picnicking. All right, so let's have a look here. So fortunately, we do have these three days leading up. So let's just go in here because this is for me more important or as important than what actually transpired. We can all agree what transpired is horrific. And believe me, it was, unfortunately. Now, arriving in this location, right? March 29, 2014. Now, I don't have the exact time when they arrived but let's just look at it on this day we got 11 2 now i have done some work just to give me guidance but i haven't done the whole lot so here we go 
Already on this day, we start with an 11.2. Now, it's a little bit shaky, a little bit uncertainty in the air. Um, of course, we can say traveling in a new country can be a little bit wobbly because particularly in a country that doesn't necessarily speak English as a first language. And of course, these two tourists don't speak English as a first language either. So that could be one thing. 14.5 alludes to that as well. Foreign country, foreign nationals, that kind of thing. Um, but what bothers me about the three days leading up is that if I take the perspective of the people waiting to receive them, where I believe play a very significant part in this situation. The people that received the two ladies or were involved in some way, shape, form or manner in arranging their arrival and accommodation where they stayed play a significant role in this situation, I believe. And I'm just going to put a orange block here because what I, I meditated on this last night, um, but I, I wasn't ready to record the show until this morning. And also just to be a bit fresher. Um, the numbers leading up or the numbers that are around the two tourists in this location are alarming. These aren't uh, holiday numbers, okay? Let's put it that way. There's treachery going on in the background here. Now, this is the first time I've truly looked at this case. Of course, I was aware of it around and when it happened. It was horrific. Even the energy, just the energy read then was bad. It's still bad. There, there's horrible numbers around these two ladies in when they get you. So 11 too shaky. Um, I did bring in their date of birth. So we'll go through it now. No. But I'm just going to do energy read first. So 14.5. That's a little bit... This, this could also bring around... Um, there may have been unexpected changes to the itinerary or accommodation or something. Uh, but there certainly was some difficulties around this day for sure. So getting in, there may have been some untruths about the place. I do believe I read yesterday that they were coming to do teaching or staying at an orphanage or teacher or something of that nature or volunteering, bigger pardon. But all, all of a sudden, now this is when night falls, right, from sunset yeah so let me just put your so as mentioned I don't have the exact time when they arrived but safe to say um, a wise tourist would get into a new area with a sufficient amount of light so we can assume uh, by sunset, thirty-nine, twelve, three years in play. And I'm just getting that sensation again, confirming my hunch, is that we have this treacherous number here, thirty-nine, twelve, three. That is... That is, it's almost like a nest, and this is the feeling and sensation I'm getting, it's like they've fallen into a trap. But when I say nest, it's like there's... I believe they, they were hoaxed into the situation. Or not... Well, hoax, we can say, in what I, what, I, what I mean by that is, come join this Walla Walla, whatever the Walla Walla is, this, that, and the other, but we have a 14.5 here. 
something was bullshit about the situation. So let me go deeper on this concept and that is when you're joining a community as supposedly they were as volunteers, right? You would want to see a 23.5. So a 23.5 23.5 community, right? So they're joining the community as volunteers. Okay. But what we have here is a hidden 32.5. And this pops its head up later. In fact, on the day of their disappearance, this exact number pops up, 32.5. So 32.5 is the opposite of making a community. And in fact, in some instances, 32.5 is about destruction of communities. So is there, we could maybe even hint at some, um, do we call it racial issues? Like the locals hate the fact that tourists keep coming in or whatever, that kind of vibe. Or there's some despisement about Europeans, Europeans, big pardon. Because 32.5 hidden, I'm sorry to say, is very problematic. And fed bullshit, 14.5. So my general sense is the people that knew of their arrival, booking, situation, is involved in their murders. There's a cohort of people killing tourists there. Now, of course, this takes place in 2014. Oh, the energy is flippin' terrible, people. And there's more coming. They probably still continued this for many years. That's what I'm feeling. Jesus. 39.12.3 is arguably one of the worst numbers you want to see, particularly around women. I may have mentioned this previously. This is, here's, it, here's the outcome of this treachery. 39.12.3 now you brings around a 21.3. And that is, now I'm not saying, hear me out. I'm not saying they were abducted on this day. Okay. What I'm saying is, the people that's, organized the situation were in the knowing that the two um, it's almost you know that feeling of turkey shoot they got two humans here you know that vibe hostile but not hostile because hostile brings around pain for money um, this is locals 14.5 locals Locals, locals of this area at the time where they were staying. This is like a horror movie when they advertise, come stay on this beautiful holiday or come do this beautiful whatever. And when they get there, treachery. Because we have one two, three, four, five negative numbers in one day here. Now, so there's this abduction theme 21.3, right? Now we've got a 12.3. So the outcome is 12.3 is soft. 12.3 is also community. So I'll also just put your... Um, 12.3 also speaks about community, right? So when they arrive, the beds are nice, the rooms are clean, the people are friendly, uh, welcome to Panama, 
It's so good you're coming to do it. Making them feel soft and comfortable. 12-3. Soft and comfortable. Ah, so they're in the nest now. Okay. What do we have here? 33, ladies and gentlemen. This is a terrible number to see around missing woman. Now, remember, we're still in the energy flow. I'm still in the energy flow of the perpetrators. Because there's evil intention around here. Look here, 33.6. Um, I would put my money on saying, and I'm putting my money on saying, I'll put my $1 and say, the people involved in their, oh, bigger pardon, their arrival at the location, the organizers, and I mentioned this early on, are involved with others. So we make them feel comfortable. Now I've just been reminded. Have a look here. 33.6. There's evidence of Lisa Ann. I hope I'm saying that properly from a Netherlands point of view. Miss Froon. 33.6. Pings on her. Yeah, 33.6. See there? So we can almost say, and of course, evidence of life, right? There yeah, she's there. 33.6 in the exact same position. 11.2 is here. She may have had some doubts, concerns. So who's lurking when the two ladies, let's go back on the next day. So this is, I'm talking about energy around them. You know, those horror movies, uh, the, the touring group arrive in this weird town and the whole town knows. I believe it's this kind of situation in, in some measure. Look what we have here. There's a big 44. Not good for young ladies. There's a group of men. Banditos. Banditos. And, and there's heavy evidence of the banditos. Here we go. 15-6 banditos. In the energy reflection zone, banditos. But we'll get there. But they present themselves as the fathers and the caring motherfuckers. But in fact, 14.5, it's all bullshit. So March 31, and what also, what 30, 31 4 is a very negative. There's so much treacherous numbers around these ladies when they arrive here. I mean, 31 4, I mean, if you take it on an orphanage or helping children, that can speak to that, yes. Can, 31 4. Uh, children's communities have broken down, families, orphans, 4. I don't know the full extent of what they were doing. But the problem for me, so already apart, well, the 34-7 is we're seeing at these close contact murders. And 34-7, it seems like everything is hunky-dory. Everything looks normal, natural. But look here, ladies and gentlemen. The sevens are out of control. It's all bullshit. It's fake. 213 member manipulation. Prince Williamness. The future blood king. Prince William. All the sevens. It's all fake. So in my opinion, the structure for most part or the main is highly involved and is aware of what happened to these young ladies, unfortunately. It's a it's a syndicate type situation. 
And when I rewatched a video yesterday, and as I was like skipping to another video, what does the video end with? There were other remains found along that embankment or the river there. What is going on here? We've got a rural, low level, hostile, movie hostile situation. And it's all bullshit. 14.5. Another, so the continuing the theme of destruction, as I mentioned, 32.5, because this is going to pop up in the kill zone, 32.5. Another um, confirmation, 41.5, breaking down. This and, and there's racial tones here. There are racial tones here. It's not only, of course, you know, do these guys like, you know, Americans and English speaking people. Because hmm. that's a, now that's a serious hint at um, racial undertones here. Whoops. So this is just the three days, the seventy-two hours, which is a blessing in a way, unfortunately to say, but f for numerology's sake, it's a blessing because we've got a seventy-two hour window here. Look at this treacherous. This this is like, beg your pardon, this is like the two young ladies here, willingly, because it all is nice, warm and cozy, walk into a nest of hornets, scorpions and savages. Now, this is what was happening, believe it or not, in my opinion, happening in the three days that they were at this location. And now we're going to look at the next uh, four days. Now, of course, with the, the actual real sequence as it happens, the two blocks, this 5, 7 is an issue for me. So I'm just pointing out problematic numbers here, right? 5 and 7 is a problem. So this is technically the day they go walking or go on their hike. And we have a 5 here. And a 5 brings around problems. And because it's a hard 5, brings around, unfortunately, serious problems. This is not a 14.5 where you bump your knee or bump your toe 5. This is a 5, a solid 5 here. The other problematic numbers is the 15.6. Because that tells me, yeah, is the older male. And of course, we have a group. Unfortunately, I do believe there's more than one. That was more than one male involved here. Yeah? It's like a group or gang. We've got these misfires of all these sevens. Now, this, this just gives me alarm bells, right? Now, what I want to do is I want to go into the energy read here. Because like I mentioned, let's look at this first day. We have this hidden 32.5 on in the day they arrive. Now, the day they go missing, now we in play 32.5. So, on one hand... 
I mean, I, 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 what I'm about to say needs to be verified, but I would assume that on March 31, the two ladies during the day or by the end of the day would have said to these people, or we're going on this walk or hike. So let's look of evidence of information. Four can be information. Four becomes a five. So they go on their hike and in play before they even leave for the hike, before they even leave for the hike, we have a three. 3257. So the hike can speak about 7, 3, the woman, now the intention 325. So when they go for their walk, we find a 358. Beg your pardon. 358, which does ping on Lisa Ann here. But from a read, from an energy read and overview, this is a treacherous physical um, number. And I will say, because one of the theories is, or well, they lost their way um, and fell and got injured. And, and of course, being in nature, the animals did the rest. So I, I, I don't believe um, this was an accident. 358. Um, so if, if I have to use a layman um, metaphor, 358, just as a metaphor, think of a vehicle, motor vehicle accident. Okay. Now think of a motor vehicle parked in a parking lot. No, it's off. No one's operating the vehicle. So how can that cause an accident? So what I'm getting to, the vehicle must have been in motion. There must have been some kind of intention for the vehicle to be in an accident. And... When we have, and this is what I'm getting to, when we have a five-year, now we're going finite. When we have a five-year human interference, so in other words, someone must have been driving the vehicle to cause the accident. And it's not them. Sorry, I'm so zoomed in, bigger pardon. It's not them. Someone must have been driving the vehicle to cause the accident. So in other words, what I'm saying is, here's the banditos. 15-6. Banditos. And when I talk about, I've just been shown, pinging. When, when the information gets shared of what's going to, what's the itinerary, because now they're looking for gaps. 14.5 is the gang in waiting. The gang, 14.5, the gang or group in waiting. And there they are, yeah, five. So this whole situation, they were funneled, if you like, into this situation. And again, because 38.11.2, I'm just showing you now, but we'll get there. There's a knowing, there's a collective knowledge of this. Two days, three days later, no one, I mean, when, when did the case break? Probably, I don't know, I don't want to say, but anyway, 38.11.2, collective knowledge. 
So not only the people, and what I'm saying is not only the people that were physically involved in the murders of the two young uh, foreign nationals, but the people that received them in some shape, way or form are involved as well. That's what I'm picking up. So again, sorry for moving around, but I must show you in comparison. So the very next day, so now this technically would be, so unfortunately, that 35.8 is a treacherous number, ladies and gentlemen. It's treacherous. And it's not only treacherous, but it's treacherous, unfortunately, to the human body. Eight. And 42.6, unfortunately, is a, not a very nice number. It's a very violent number. But the very next day, from midnight to sunrise, we have this 33.6, which was seen here. It's, it's, it's like this is the ultimate betrayal. And particularly when you're dealing with, and I, I traveled backpacker myself, I've traveled. I had a moment, I swear someone was after me. My spider senses were super awoken in an instant and I quickly made a maneuver to get away from this guy. Um, I almost got trapped in the toilets there and I realized this guy was following me. So as I was going down the stairs, I quickly turned around and, you know, that quick turnaround move. And then I just bailed out of there. I just arrived at a bus station. So we have a situation here where, come and visit us, ladies and gentlemen. 36.9. Unfortunately, does speak about the graphic nature of the crime, unfortunately. And evidence of the comment that I heard in the documentary, um, several other um, remains have been found. 16.7 of a serial nature. This is 43.7. They hate tourists. This is like, this was, I, I don't know what the situation is now, but at this time, this was like, oof, 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 oof. And, and ladies and gentlemen, not only is there knowledge within the local barbarian community, the local savage is, not all, but the ones involved. Um, and including the higher apps, authorities, officialdoms, People of authority pinging, 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 pinging. They know exactly what's going on here. So we've seen this recently with the, um, um, gosh, Taylor Cassie case in the Bahamas. And we've got the next day, as I mentioned, everyone's chatting about it. 
What do we get out of it? Because 11.2 is sharing of the loot. You know. What do they get out of it? Talky talky nice. Yeah. Look at this here. 44.8. Engineered. This is all engineered, ladies and gentlemen. This was all engineered. 44.8. Not included the other pictures for a reason because empath levels are very high. So unfortunately, ladies and gentlemen, we of course know what the outcome is or was. But in my opinion, the people involved, whether getting them there, the people responsible when they arrived there and the little banditos waiting in the jungle uh, while the authorities laugh and giggle behind their desks. Um, there's a, let's call it for a lack of a better word, a syndicate or operation happening here, in my opinion. Motherfuckers. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's what I have on this case. Very, yeah, man, this case pinged on me when it happened. It pinged on me forever. What lovely people. All right, ladies and gentlemen, please leave your comments and thoughts. I do love engage with them. Please enjoy your weekend. Stay safe, stay alert. See you in the next one. Bye for now.